I know you guys know a lot about, um, you know, rap and, you know, you know who Old Dirty Bastard is, right? So, in reference to uh, the Shinnecock tribe, as you see here, uh, now here's a little bit of the uh, ancestral history to Old Dirty Bastard. The drugs, the crime, the poverty. These were tough neighborhoods, but there were also places where his family had been for countless generations. In fact, Dirty could trace his lineage back to a time when there was no New York City, just the wilderness of North America. He was one quarter Shinnecock Indian. Then he started mentioning things that y'all didn't understand. He said he got the grandfather Cuffy, Chief Cuffy. I'm taking him to Chief Cuffy. Him and his brothers, Fred Cuffy, you know, they were some wild horses. Oh, my great 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 grandfather was an Indian chief, Shinnecock from the Shinnecock Reservation in Long Island, Riverhead. So that's where my mother met my father in Long Island. Dirty just carried his heritage to the to the, the limit, you know, we're Indians. I say, and then he used to say, yeah, we Indian, we sold Manhattan. I said, well, listen, they sold Manhattan for trinkets. So he always said, well, we're gonna try to get it back. I said, Rusty, please. You're not getting it back, so get it. The Indian, the soul man, I entered the white man, my grandfather. So you heard it, you know, old dirty bastard, you know, his his mom, Shinnecock, his, his grandfather. All right, he, he even sang it in the, in the rap song you just heard there. I'm talking about Chief Cuffy. That's my mother's father. Now I'm talking about my grandmother. My father, she's history. That's Reverend Milliton. Now, Reverend Milton, he had a church, started the first Baptist church. He died in 103, was never seen now, always knew what he's talking about. But he was back in slavery time, back in slavery time. And to hear him speak of what happened, it was, I just, I just couldn't believe it. But he was free and he came up to New York to find a place for my grandmother. This was his area when he came up from the South, all up down here. It's right about here. This is where my grandfather's house was, right here. This is Bridge Street. And this is his house in the 1900s. So I got two historic legacies in my family, on my grandmother's side and my grandfather's side. So imagine these two people get together and have children. That's where we come from. That's where Dirty come from. That's where Ray Ray come from. That's where 12 come from. Shit, you murder all it down the line. He was the first one that I ever heard, you know, go on the TV, national television, and say that the black man is God. You know, and that that right there was on the um, Arsenio, Arsenio Hall show. The government brainwashed our people with the mind control theory. That's what they do. So they make sure our people like it. They keep playing that same song. The same song keep playing, other like it. Start to, program. Program. Start, to start to get cloned with it. So then for the clone exists, then it just takes over. It takes over the human body. It takes over the spirit. It takes over the soul. And therefore, behold, that's what you got. That's why Dirty is here for. Dirty here just to keep it dirty. 
dirty, 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 where we all come from. I'm not crazy at all, okay? Everybody always saying that dirty is crazy. Dirty is not crazy at all. Dirty just see, foresee a lot that a lot of people don't foresee. He fell off the stage when he in the concert. When he went to the studio and he asked somebody for a painkiller. And that's what did it. They gave him the painkiller. And he never woke up. Never woke up. No. Are you an Indian? Yes. Oh really? Oh my god. I thought you were a black guy. Hey. You're Indian? <laughs> yeah. Oh come on, man. Yeah, you gotta be too. Are you? Like Tonto Indian? Shinnecock Indian. Really? You're Shinnecock? Yes. Oh, I didn't know you're Shinnecock. Yeah, you could have fooled me. That's the kind I am. <laughs> so you should be Big Chief Bastard, not all the time. His family was here when Columbus landed, huh? Oh, is that right? Yeah. So you're not a black man, you're an Indian. I'm an Indian. No kidding. I, now, this is a shock. We are learning more today. Hey, you look totally black. Uh, yeah, it's definitely an you know, Indian. Wow. Definitely. <laughs> I doubt this is a shock. Yeah. So you are not a black man, you're an Indian. I'm an Indian. No kidding. I doubt this is a shock. Yeah. So you are not a black man, you're an Indian. I'm an Indian. No kidding. I doubt this is a shock. Yeah. So you are not a black man, you're an Indian. I'm an Indian. We're Indians. The Indian is so mad. I heard the white member grandfather.